which makes it infinitely more badass. I smell death. Oh my god. Silencer, at last you've arrived. Fear not, for the crisis that has threatened the Dark Brotherhood has finally come to an end. Oh no. I am Arquin, speaker for the Black Hand. As you can see, we have dealt with the betrayer, Lucian Lachan. No! No longer will you serve as his puppet. What have you done? It seems Lachance wanted revenge against the Dark Brotherhood for some reason, and used you to do his dirty work. But now we can begin anew. I bestow upon you the title of Speaker. You will take Lucian Lachance's you. place on the Black Hand. You murdered my last yeah. friend! As you know, the Black Hand is now in a state of disarray. Lachance ordered you to kill us off. We five, including you, are now all that remain. Even worse, you killed the listener! The Black Hand without a listener is like a hand with no thumb. Even the listener's successor is dead. Who the hell is his successor? So, we have no choice but to invoke an ancient ritual. We must wake the Night Mother from her slumber and seek her guidance. The Night Mother? Between the hours of midnight and 3 a.m., ask me about the Night Mother, and we will away to Our Lady's home. Only then will the ritual begin. But Lucien Lachance was innocent! I can't believe this. This is unbelievable. You killed my last and only friend, Lucien Lachance! When we confronted Lachance, he tried to defend himself, tried to declare his innocence. But we would not hear his treacherous lies. No! As you can see, he was no match for the combined power of the Black Hand, even weakened as we are. I can't believe it. This is no time. Yeah, yeah, I, I heard you. May the Night Mother hold you in her cold embrace. I suppose I should don the black hand armor in that case. <sighs> God damn it, they killed my only last friend. First they make me kill off everyone in the sanctuary, and then they kill make me kill off everyone. They they kill off my last friend, Lucian. Can't believe this. What a treachery. <sighs> Just checking out this new robe, you know. The black hand welcomes you. What have you done, man? We... Our troubles are almost at an end, sister. Soon we will visit the night mother, and she will surely guide us. You're walking right into the traitor's trap, you know. The four of us attacking him in unison was as graceful and beautiful as a ballet. The flashing of steel, the spraying of blood. This is exactly what the traitor wanted. Sithis be with you. You are like an unholy vision. He wanted so beautiful. vengeance on Lucian and he got it. Re Lucian Lachance has been murdered, stripped, and mutilated. Greetings, fellow speaker. Greetings, Speaker. You look like the Grey Fox. Most of my time is now spent on administrative duties. <laughs> He's a bookie. I have not had blood on my hands in far too long. Killing Lachance was pure ecstasy. Wow. You're crazy, man. Sithis is What about you? Hello, fellow Speaker. Welcome to the Black Hand. So nice to see you're in one piece. Right. You should take some time to admire his corpse. It really is a thing of beauty. The punctures and slashes are almost poetic. Okay. I'm getting kind of nervous talking to this guy. May you always walk in the shadow of death. Does anyone else agree that that guy has the creepiest face ever? I don't know. I, I just... May we forever serve the Night Mother. I just think he's creepy as hell. Dear Speaker, when darkness... Uh, when is that? You must understand our need for darkness and... So I guess we'll just hang around until 3 a.m. then? Anyone brought a pack of cards? No? 
Some Scrabble? Nothing? Well... May we forever serve the Night Mother. I guess we can poke we his corpse. Is that is that a good is that okay with everyone? Well, you you want to poke his corpse for a couple hours? Actually, make that like almost twelve hours. Jesus Christ! Can't believe how long we have to wait poking his corpse for that long. Right. May we forever serve the night. Can we go now? Dear speaker. What? May the night mother hold you. Wait. Don't tell me I got it wrong. Oh god damn it. I thought it was after 3 a.m. Motherfucker, it was between midnight and 3 a.m. Yeah, of course. I'm so goddamn smart. Do I hear a clock noise? What the hell? I hear a small clock or something. Man, I'm going crazy. It's time. Dear speaker, when the night mother must be awakened so that we may seek her guidance. Are you ready to travel now to her resting place? I don't think we have a choice. Even though we're walking right into the traitor's trap, but whatever. Very good, and so it begins. The Black Hand's journey into a darkness few can imagine. Let us be off. The Night Mother awaits. If you say so. <sighs> this place again. Honor thy mother. Ungalim's bow is right there. Behold oh. the Night Mother. The locals call this statue the lucky old lady. They have no idea how lucky they really are. For this stone effigy masks the entrance into the Dark Brotherhood's most revered unholy site. Really? The Crypt of the Night Mother herself. Oh my god. In a moment we will begin. I will recite an incantation, and we can proceed down into the crypt and seek an audience with the Night Mother. I know this is all very overwhelming, dear child. Just follow along, and you'll be fine. Now, let's go see what the future holds, shall we? Right. Precisely. Unholy matron, we of the Black Hand beseech you. Reveal yourself now, most magnificent Night Mother, so that we may seek your guidance. Do I have something to drink? Empty can. Oh my god, the statue is dancing. Oh. In we go. I don't see a door, though. I hope no one sees us, because all the lights are turned on. Maybe I should change my equipment around a minute. The Lunar Crescent. Just like that. Let's go into the Crypt of the Night Mother. What is the meaning of this desecration? Who has disturbed my ancient slumber? Dearest Night Mother, most unholy maiden, please, we beg your mercy in this our time of need. The Black Hand seeks your guidance. Ah, yes, I have been expecting you. The listener now kneels by Sithis, as does his successor. There is a traitor amongst you. The traitor is dead, dear mother. We have come now to ask your blessing. Anoint one of us your listener so we can restore the Black Hand. Foolish little girl. Lucy and Lachance. I knew it all along! Dying breath. The Black Hand remains tainted by betrayal. Restoration is impossible. Enough. Enough of this. You will all suffer for the pain you have caused me. I will destroy your night mother, and the Dark Brotherhood will fall. Oh god, he's got crazy moves. The traitor still lives. It is Matthew Belmont. Do not let him harm the night mother. Kill him. The lead singer of Muse? But I like that guy. Oh god. Matthew Bellamont! Huh. 
Ah! We finished him off. So, at last we meet. I have been following your strange journey through the Dark Brotherhood, young one. Hi, Mom! Your killing of the old man Baneland, the execution of Adamus Villada, the way you stalked and murdered each member of the Draconis family, I stalked him, all right. Your purification of the Jaden Hall Don't Sanctuary. remind me, please! You, a mere underling, even managed to single-handedly eliminate half of my black hand. Fuck yeah. I only live to serve. I know, dear child, I know. You carried out your orders to the letter in the name of the black hand. How could I be anything but happy with you? I don't know. No, my anger lies with the rest of my children. You see, I have known of Matthew Bellamont's intentions since he was just a boy. I knew of his thirst for vengeance. I could have informed my listener, but I refused. Refused to reward such incompetence. Ungallin was weak. He sure was. He died in like two hits. Indeed, I allowed Matthew Bellamont to proceed on his destructive course. Just as I allowed you to intercept him. That means you're the reason Lucian Lachance is dead! But... but why? Don't you see? Our dread father foresaw your defeat of the traitor here in this very crypt. You have been chosen. You are to be my new listener. What's that? I didn't catch that. You possess strength and cunning and a heart as well, that's not nice. You were marked by sickness the moment you emerged from your mother's womb. Nanoke's a bad guy? I think you got me mixed up with someone else, Mom. Someone who kind of looks like Nanoke, but kind of doesn't. Almost looks identical, but looks totally different at the same time. Some of you might know who I am referring to. I'm not going to give it away, but I am talking about someone I'm not rambling. What happens now, dear mother? Go, take a few moments to collect yourself. Meditate upon all that has transpired. Help yourself to any treasures this crypt may offer. Treasures? When you are ready, speak with me again. And I will deliver you safely to the only place you can truly call home. But... The Chayden Hall But, 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 the place is empty! There is much work to be done. Much work? And when you are back in the sanctuary, speak with Arquen. She will serve as your humble servant and guide. Oh, I know there's work to be done, all right. But not just because I'm the listener. I had to go out and do something, you know what I'm saying? I had to go and download some goddamn mods, bitch! I'll kill you! I'll kill you all! I'm the real traitor! Not really, I'm... I'm joking. It was a joke! She lets me take the treasure. Okay, mom. I'll just desecrate your fucking crypt. Thanks, whatever. I'm not gonna refuse. Matthew Bellamont. Oh, I really want those black robes. I really want those. Those are really... They have really good stats. And I can use them to make some of my equipment more interesting. The five tenets. Brothers of Darkness. Whew, look at these awesome items. And I can just take them. Thanks, Mom. Oh my god, dead... Babies! And this must be the Night Mother herself. I'll just take all these offerings to her. Did I loot this one already? Ah, I did not. Most excellent. Oh, I'm gonna be over encumbered any minute. Can't take up anything else. The Night Mother wishes for you to take some time to consider your new position. I considered it all right. We will speak when we are back in the sanctuary. Sure. I'm ready, Night Mother. You've returned. I trust you've weighed the importance of your new position. 
for you will soon hear words that will change lives, alter destiny. Really? And I hope you've taken everything you desire from my crypt. Once you leave, you will be unable to return. Now, are you ready to begin your new life? Well, I wanted to take those dead babies, but, uh... You know. Can't really loot them. Let's go home. I'm tired of this. Very good. Now begins your true journey. We will soon become very intimate. Ooh! <laughs> Nanoka is gonna get it on with the Night Mother. Well, isn't that just kinky as hell? Before I send you away, however, I would like to present you with a rather special reward. Oh! I see you still possess the Blade of Woe, the weapon given you by Lucy Lachance when you first met. Allow I possess it still because I cannot remove it from the inventory without the console! Yes, you will now find the Blade of War a bit more potent than it was. Now go. Leave this crypt and serve our dread father till your dying breath. I will never die. So I guess that means I'll never stop serving Sithis. But that's just silly, isn't it? The blade of woe was removed and the blade of woe was added. Oh, the stupid blade of woe over encumbered me. I can't believe it. Also, let's take off the hood and reveal Nanoke's pretty hair. The new listener for the Dark Brotherhood. Behold her grace. Right? That's right. Her grace. Also, let's check out the blade of woe. It still sucks two dicks. But at least it's droppable now. Just like this axe. Fuck the axe! Oh. Well. We don't have any members, though. I... You honor us with your I... I, I kinda killed everyone here, you know. Honored listener. I offer myself as your humble servant and guide. Please allow me to mentor you in your new role. Here's what I believe we should do next. I will stay here and attempt to reestablish this sanctuary. Damn right. I will begin recruiting new members. Are you my speaker? You must fulfill your new duties. The statue in Breville serves as a conduit between the Night Mother and the listener. Right. Once a week, you must visit the statue. Talk to it. You will be presented with a list of names and locations. These are people who have prayed to the Night Mother. They request a visit from a speaker to arrange someone's assassination. Right. All you need to do is visit the statue once a week, get the list of names and locations, and pass it on to me here in the sanctuary. Well, that sounds simple enough. Do this, and I will give you your share of the sanctuary's week. There's plans. money in this business? There's so much work to be I done. thought we were just in it for the so blood, you know? much work. Psychopaths and all that, you know? Well, you're the crazy bitch, so I'll just listen to you. Still. Do I still have my necklace equipped? Bitch ass, I do. Whispers of death. Once a week, I must... Okay. There's no penalty if I choose not to do it. Well, there better not be a goddamn penalty. I'm the goddamn listener. These bitches better listen to me! No, no, okay. Listener of the Dark Brotherhood! With the angry rage voice. Isn't that nice? It is... Fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. It looks like Nanoke has embraced her dark side. I'm not so sure that's a good decision, but... Hey. It's her life. Right, Nanoke? I'm sorry! Aw. You know I love you, right? I'll take that as a yes. Right? Mm-hmm. Whoa! I'm stalling, sorry. The episode's over, I think. Goodbye.